In this video I'm gonna show you how to create this driving school uh, website. It's mainly for driving school but it's highly customizable so you can use it for pretty much anything. And I'm gonna show you exactly how to build this website step by step. So if you like it, keep watching. Okay, so there are two things you need in able to do this website. The first thing is hosting. For this I recommend hosting here because they're cheap and reliable. The cheapest hosting plan costs two bucks per month and that would be that's that will be enough for most of you guys it's for one web 10,000 uh, visits per monthly but uh, if you expect more or want to create several websites you can go with the uh, premium version and you can have up to 25,000 visitors per month and you can and you will also get a free domain that costs about 10 bucks so that's what you need for hosting and you also need a theme called Avada this theme costs $69 but it's only a one-time fee so once you bought it, you will have it for forever and uh, you will all also get all the updates for free. Okay, so once you have bought Hostinger, you want to log into your account and you want to click on hosting up here. And you want to click on add website and you want to create a new website and you want to create a WordPress website and you want to create an account and continue. And once you have done that, I will show you exactly how to set up. The entire website. Okay, so once you're done setting up your website, you wanna go back to Hostinger and you wanna click on websites up here and you wanna edit your website. And you will get to this page. And the first thing you wanna do is go into appearance here, hover on appearance, click on fit. And here you wanna click add new and you wanna upload theme. But first, you need to download the WinRAR file from Envato Market or FeedForward. And you want to go up to your account here and you wanna click on downloads. And you will get to this page and you want to click on this and click on instead click on this one ball wordpress file only and you also want to download this text file right here and once you have done that you want to go back to your website and you want to upload the file open install i can do it install it's gonna unpack the theme once you have done that you wanna, you're gonna see this icon up here avada and you want to go to the dashboard and you want to scroll down to see this this is the text file you downloaded so this file you got here the text file you want to open that and you will get a code and you want to paste that code right here and click register okay so once I've done all that you want to hover here on website and click on it you want to scroll down and search on drive and you want to import and you want to import all the content and click import and click OK Okay, so once it's finished, you want to click on done right here. And now the first thing you want to do is click hover on appearance right here and click on customize. Once you're at this page, you can see your preview how the page looks right now, exactly how, as I showed you in the beginning. And the first thing you want to do is click on site identity. Here you want to change it to your company name. And also if you have a tagline, you choose it here. And you can also upload a site icon. It should be 512 by 512 pixels and you can create it easily on Canva. It's totally free and I will leave the link down in the description. If you don't know, a site icon is this icon right here if you want your logo here for example. Then you want to hit publish to save it and uh, yeah, let's go back. Once we're back here, you want to click on live builder. And this is where you do all the customization for the website. So 
as you can see, just hover, change the text here to change the text. And once you're satisfied, click save. And if you wish to change the logo, hit edit header layout section. And here you change the logo by clicking it on this little pencil. Remove it here, click here, and you can upload the files, your own logo here. Uh, and click save once you're satisfied. But let's go back to the front page. Okay, so that's how you customize the basic things. Let's say you wanna customize this form or either you maybe want to remove it. Just hover on it, delete element. Change the text, by just changing it, save. And uh, let's say, button options right here. Here you can see the button URL. So once they click this button, they will come to this URL. You can change the button text here and you can also change the alignment of the button here. If you want it to align to left or centric, etc. Mm. And yeah, that's how you customize your website. Easy as does. If you want a booking system, I'm not gonna go through that. If you want that for your website, there's plenty of uh, other uh, videos that show that kind of system. I can link one below. And uh, yeah, good luck with your website. Hopefully, uh, you learned something. And if you need any help, you can leave a comment below and I will try to help you as soon as possible. Thank you. Bye.